guys, how's it going? And welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys have had a blessed Saturday. It is the night before my birthday. And guys, thanks for showing up. If you ain't done it before, go hit that subscribe button. If you ain't seen it yet, then you're going to see my name right next to it. My name is Justin, guys. And as you can see, we have another brand new guest on the channel. You guys may know him, may not know him. If you've been on the Facebook Live, then you definitely know who he is, guys. His name is Eddie. And Eddie, what do you want to tell these people about yourself What's going on, today? guys? Uh, I'm Eddie. I'm 25. I'm originally from Trevor, North Carolina. I'm a singer-songwriter. You can check out Eddie James Wall Music on YouTube and Eddie James Wall Music on Facebook. Just click the link. Got a couple songs out. Check it out. See if you like it. I'll put the link to his YouTube channel in the description below, and we will roll with it. So, as you guys can see, we have Buffalo Trace here tonight. It is a wonderful whiskey. We is... We is this is a hard one to get your hands on for a lot of the local area around here. Uh, it is a one purchase per person, and it is a roughly forty bucks, I believe, thirty, roughly around in there. Uh, great whiskey, awesome guys. You know I have done this video before, but however, this is for him. We're gonna let him try something that he has not had yet off my wonderful shelf. So guys, we're gonna jump right on into it. We're gonna pull that aluminum cap off, pop that top, and then we're gonna put there it is. We're gonna pour our pour spout. We're not going to go too heavy today. we got a long night ahead of us. Yes, We're please. pushing in for my birthday. That bottle's not All right, so that's not going to work in there today, so we're going to pour them regularly. Um, usually I go about a part and a half-ish, roughly around in there. Um, and then same for me. We will be trying this out. Well, he will, and he's going to let you guys know his opinion, and I will definitely redo my opinion because some people that I've watched other videos on, they're like, the second time I've come back to it, it tasted way different, and it's dropped in proof or it's dropped in power. So I'm curious to see how it goes. All right, so what do you get when you smell it? Like, what is the first nose? Well, uh, I smell more of you know, straight whiskey than anything. More like, uh, you really want to jump into, like, a, a certain smell like they smell like me i kind of get like a butterscotchy yeah. floral smell yeah i can smell kind of like a flower butter, yeah. almost and it's really like almost like a spiciness yeah to it. yeah it has it's kind of near neck with a um almost like a jim beam yeah that's what i got a hand of it has, like yeah because this is made in kentucky it is definitely within that same a long line tradition of how Kentucky makes their bourbons. Right. And you can kind of tell by how their bottle is shaped. If you've ever looked at the Jim Beam special bottles, they kind of have that little wave curvature going to it. Um, I'm not going to read the whole background on the back of this one again, but this has something to do with a great buffalo and a whole bunch of other stuff to come back from when they were making uh, the trek across the country. And they found the water and everything else, and then the bam, bang, bang, wah, bah, boom. Here we go. We got a wonderful drink here. So, uh, we're going to let him try it first, and uh, we're going to go ahead and sip it and see what you say. Cheers. Cheers. It's got a good flavor to it. It does. I like it. Not too bad of an afterburn either. It's really rich. It has a, um, a vanilla note that's really hard to tell on the nose. Like, I got to... Compared to the first time, I believe I don't remember saying it. It's, then again, it's been almost a month, but... There was a huge vanilla note for me in there this time that was just overwhelmingly compared to a the normal first time that I'd done this. First time I got it, I think I got a really heavy butterscotch flavor. Yeah, I got the butterscotch and then the afterbite was more of a vanilla flavor to me. So, and what I do enjoy about this is the burn. There's not like a huge body burn. It's, it's enough just to feel. Mm -hmm. it. It's so. like, hey, I'm a whiskey. I kind of feel good. And we're going to kind of roll with it. And that's what I really enjoy about the Buffalo Trace. Is it doesn't really necessarily hit you really hard. But for it to be a 90 proof, yeah, that ain't bad. you can't necessarily tell it by the burn that it gives off inside your chest. No. No, that's pretty good. What would you compare it to? If out of everything that you've had, could you compare this? To necessarily anything else you've ever had? I mean, I, I I'd say like the smell kind of smells like Jim or Jack to me, but the uh, the burn I don't know. I've never had something went down so smooth except for Crown X Soda. Crown X Soda goes down really smooth. So you say you get a smell from Jack? Yeah. All right. So smell this, and then smell your glass again, and tell me if you get the same transition. No. So that's what's really weird about the Kentuckiness in it. Is like, uh, we'll go to the Wild Turkey. One of the, this is the Kentucky Spirit 
It is their single barrel. Now smell that and smell it. That's kind of got a same smell. Though. Yeah, that's uh, coming off the same location. Drop that glass. Locational uh, mixtures is what really hints off on things. Now, I do believe that this has exceeded its preference. A lot of people find it uh, really hard to get their hands on, but not nearly as good as it should be to yeah. be getting your hands on yeah. that hard. So it's like rare to find. Yeah, like uh, when I bought this one, it was one. It was one bottle per person, and it was like uh, thirty-five dollars, I believe. And the escrow in the price is going up because not necessarily the quality, yeah. but how much people are wanting to buy it. Right. It's like Jameson. Uh, the millennials come up and they were like, bam, Jameson's the shit. Mm -hmm. Jameson used to not be as expensive as it is, but now it's closer to that $30 range to yeah. buy a bottle of Jameson. However, now if you buy the uh, the McGregor drink, the proper 12, it's cheaper than Jameson and yep. tastes better. So it's all about the name, and it's all about what you guys actually look into, the actual flavor. Yeah. That's, it's, it's pretty good. Mm. You want to edit this out there? <laughs> it's fine. Um, you take this out. No, it's fine. I don't edit anything out. It kind of just rolls in it. Um, do you have anything coming out soon, music-wise? Well, I'm looking to actually, uh, when all the COVID's over, I'm thinking about going to record a six-song EP. I'm working, I got a studio that I'm going to that I've talked to, Scat 3 Productions, and... Uh, I guess once all this COVID settles down, I'm going to release uh, my first single, which is going to be Carolina Country. You've heard that mm -hmm. one. And then I'm going to follow it up with a new one I'm writing called Drinking Over You, which uh, we're on, I'm almost finished writing that one. And then I got uh, I got traditional country music that I, I wrote the title to. I got like two verses to that I'm, that's probably going to be on there too. So I'm probably, within, hopefully within the next year, I'll have my six song EP released. So there's a lot coming out, guys. So you, like you said, you can go find him out at Eddie Wall on YouTube, Facebook. Instagram, all those fancy dancy sites, you can find him there. Um, also, another note pressing towards us. Tomorrow is my birthday. We are having a little bit of get together tonight, but tomorrow is my birthday. We're at 149 subscribers. We are uno mas away from our goal, and I would love to hit that by tomorrow for my birthday. So, guys, if you're watching this, again, my name is Justin. Hit that subscribe button, become part of the family. This is Eddie, he is part of the family, and I do not mind bringing people on here for a guest invite. Um, I'm down for it, we can do whatever. Um, if you're close, it's, makes it makes it way easier. So if you're far away, maybe we can work something out. But rules to the giveaway, if you're over 21, you get a bottle. If you're under 21, we'll figure something out. Only way to win is be a subscriber, guys. Thanks for watching. My name's Justin. I'm Eddie. And he's Eddie. So we're gonna kinda roll with it. We're gonna see how the night goes. And we're going to drink with you guys. If you don't drink, hopefully you drink with me. And if you don't drink at all, I'm sorry. But thanks for watching. Welcome to the family. Hit that subscribe button. I'm Justin. That's Eddie. And remember, guys, as always, cheers. I buy it so you guys don't have to. I try it so you guys don't have to. And we do stuff that way you guys don't have to. Hit that like button. Smash the comments if you want any new drinks, new additives, anything that you want to bring into the channel. You let me know in the comments. You guys have been awesome in the comments lately. We have had a ton. We got a lot of new stuff coming up this week. All because of you guys. Remember guys, that notification bell lets you know every single time we go live. We post a video every single day. We go live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Except for Friday, we don't post one video. But we just go live. And until next time, and until later, tomorrow's Sunday with another brand new video. And as always, guys, I'll catch you later. Till then, see ya.